Look at our walk that we get to take to our boat. So beautiful. It's day one of projects on the new boat. This is the aft cabin, which is going to be where the boys hang out and sleep. It's got a big, I don't know, queen-ish, double-ish bed here and a single bunk over there. Uh, it's a pretty funny little cave down here because we're under the cockpit, but it feels very dark because all they have are these little portholes. And uh, so we're going to do the big naughty and paint a lot of this teak white. Um, definitely the sides, the flats, and the base where their feet are. And I'm going to probably be painting all the bulkheads white with a teak trim just to brighten things up because that's our style. We like light and bright. And that's throughout the boat. So they have a little bulkhead here too we'll paint. And yeah, this is project one for me because I want the boys to have a spot to hang out while we're doing all the other work. And this room also needs the most work. So it seems like painting is a lot of just waiting around for paint to dry. So I have all these like micro projects going on in between. <laughs> what are we working on? We're working on the boys' stateroom, which was this very dark little hole back here. I'm lighting it up with some paint and I've got some of it primed. I just need to finish off the primer tonight and then try and match the paint to the roof which is kind of an off-white and the other project I have on the go is pretzels, pretzels. <laughs> is trying to do something about this emerald green countertop and backsplash. I love it. No, I do not. It's not my style at all, but it's really well done. So I'm trying to cover the counters with contact paper and then I got some stick-on tiles for the back. So step one is to remove all of the silicone that they put in to seal the counter. But if you try and get it against the laminate as good as you can and run it down. And then what? Use tweezers or something? No, and then run it down this way. What's that noise? I don't know. And it should just pop up. Oh, wow. Contact paper, take 1000, and I think I'm on to something. <laughs> I'm lining up one edge perfectly, and I'm slowly going to work it into place. hours ago said I'm gonna do this contact paper and sticky tiles and I've done one section of contact paper and one square of sticky tiles. Are you happy with it? 
I would say like so-so. There's some ripples here I'm not super keen on. But yeah, I think it's, I like it. I don't know. So this room is really dark. Um, there's only like three little uh, windows in here. So we decided to paint some of the teak white and add some lighting just to make it a bit brighter. There's a whole chunk of just wiring everywhere down here. So this deal was just big bird's nest of wires. And then you just have to kind of trace where they are. I don't know if you can see in there. But it all came through this hatch. Then this hatch here. But most of them weren't even doing anything. So I got rid of those and now I can start putting this bed back together and we can get the kids mattress in here. And then we can start sleeping on the boat. Birdie. I've got all those channels in up there. All the wires. Wow, it looks so much cleaner in yeah. here. Okay. This room looks a million times better already. Yeah. And all we've done is prime it. Yeah. It looks really good. It does. Have a... <laughs> okay, well I'm gonna get in here and tape and try to get two coats done today. Yeah. Thanks for all your hard work There's last a lot of night. Cleaning, moving everything. And I know. Stuff away. It's endless. Fine. It's endless. But it felt great. I think I'm pretty happy with the paint. When she did a little test strip, it looked really good. So awesome. that's what I will do today. So, we've owned our new boat for a solid 10 days. And uh, we really just jumped straight into boat work. It's crazy how much work we've done already. We've spent every weekend all day here. We get here Friday after work and we work straight through. But we've got a lot done and it feels good. And I feel like we're like deliriously exhausted and super happy. <laughs> it's like we're parents of a newborn or something. <laughs> Anyway, it's good. The boys' room has been sanded, sanded and painted and well, it was just crazy ratsness of wiring everywhere. Mick has fixed all that up and we're pretty close to being able to put the mattresses back in and it being sleepable and once it's sleepable um, we can stay here because our room's totally sleepable. And uh, today I have my bestest friend Hattie coming to help me and our goal tonight is to sand the main salon bulkheads that are going to be painted white with the teak trim and uh, yeah she should be here soon and I'm gonna clear out the salon of as much stuff as possible and then we'll hang up some plastic and we'll get sanding and I'll be really happy if we get it all sanded tonight I'll be even happier if we are able to tape it off and get ready to prime it. That's the plan. Helping me sand. Sure Is my sander helper today? Look at this fine work. Wow, it looks so different. Thanks for being here, Hattie. You're the best. Of course. Wouldn't miss it. Well, I think that's a little extreme, but sure. <laughs> it's a part of the journey. Look at us. 
killing it. We've sanded, we're taping. And now we're gonna paint. You're the best helper, Hattie. Thank you. You're welcome. We've gotten so much more done tonight than I expected. It's awesome. I'm so thankful for Hattie's help. Nice primer. This primer is the bomb. It seems to work really good. Pretty pleased with it. Invest in a good primer. It's worth it. Almost done this whole side. And then just two little short bits on the other side and voila. If you look over towards the kitchen, the white from the backdrop and the white up here, it just got so much brighter in here. Turn around, take a look. Yay! Oh, and it's dark out too. See, look at you this. See that there? Look at how much brighter it is. And it looks so good. I mean, it's just primer, but I'm obsessed with it. We're getting there. It looks really good. It's so much brighter. You guys look. Look at how much brighter it is. Woo! Oh, like this view? I know. Is spectacular. And if you come all the way back here and you look over at the kitchen, even if you're just getting that tiny little thumbnail of what's been done already. Look at how much brighter that space gets. Yeah, I love it. My goodness, we made it. Oh, I don't know, the walls are pretty cold to be painting. I don't know. I'd really like to get it done today though. We'll see. I'm a bit afraid we might be a bit crazy. I mean, you have to be a bit crazy to like do all the things we've done. But I think today might be topping the list for crazy days. Just, you know, it's like, I don't even want to guess how much wind there is, but there's a lot of wind. And uh, we thought, you know, it's a good day to come down to the boat and get some work done. I've got my last little bit of taping and then two coats of paint and the interior paint is done and I'm very excited because taping and painting is not my favorite thing even though it is instantly gratifying it's time consuming but last little bit to tape and hopefully I'll get the painting done today. That would be so exciting. And then I can put the boat back together and we might be able to sleep here tomorrow night. <gasps> That's very exciting. Our bed is really cold out, so I'm bundled. How's it going in here? Good. Well, there's a really small screws. I don't know if I have a drill bit small enough. Oh. I might be able to uh, partially drill it and then just hand bomb the rest. What are you doing? Installing some low voltage buck lights. Just make kind of a little uh, bracket or spacer that'll screw to the roof like that. And then the light will go on. I'm gonna oh. tuck the wire in the channel. That'll look nicer than the big clunky mismatched things that were on the wall before. Yeah. We're almost done in this room. I know, <laughs> I've spent a lot of time in this room, it's very awkward. <laughs> Where were you thinking the bookshelf? Back there. So like, however far out, but keep it the same height as this? Yeah, but on the back wall. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. That's great, because I can just screw to that. And white? Sure. Whatever's easier. White. Okay, white. <laughs> it is. Well, whatever this creamy white is. Yeah, we'll just paint it. It's scary outside. 